Hi guys, thanks for joining me at the channel again tonight. We're going to make a bag tonight that's going to involve a little bit of vinyl leather, a little bit of fabric. It's not real hard. It doesn't take a lot of time. I think you'll enjoy it. So let's get started. This is a brown, but it's got some undertones of a darker brown in it. Really pretty fabric. And we're going to measure off 16 by 16. That's going to do it. Okay. And we're going to begin by sewing up the seam and sewing down the bottom. So we're going to sew the side, make a side seam, and sew across the bottom. So we've sewn across the bottom and we've sewn down the side. We didn't have to do this side because, of course, it was folded. Just stick your hand inside of the corner, pinch it, and release. Okay? And you've got a nice point, a nice point. Measure down from that point three inches. Measure down three inches and sew all the way across. Now you've sewn across here and you've sewn across here. We're just going to cut off the tips. You see with that vinyl leather it's not that hard to do to cut it off. What you might also want to do if you have any threads that are kind of hanging, just cut those off. Now if you happen to have some fabric hanging around and you don't have enough of that fabric to make a bag or to make something really big out of it, go get the fabric. We're going to add it to the bag. The fabric I'm using is just an old scrap of fabric. It's actually a very beautiful color. It's got some nice gold tones in it, a little bit of red. You can kind of see that a little bit better. It's kind of a paisley. And what I did was I made two strips from that that are going to go right across the top of this. But it's not going to go across the top the way you think it is. This is the right side. This is the wrong side. This is the right side. We're going to put the right side down on here and sew it across. Now we've sewn this band all the way around it and we're just going to lift up the band to the right side okay so far so good we've cut off a strip and that strip measures actually it measures about an inch but that's just about what we need to take it all the way around now the next step is this bag needs some handles. So here's what we ended up with. It's a tote. It's a shopper. It's one of those things where you could put your gym clothes in it and run to the gym. As for the straps, I ended up taking a belt and cutting it in half and then just sewing it uh, to the top of this. So I cheated a little bit because I just did Velcro to close it. So there's a Velcro opening as you can hear. Now I had a little bit of the uh, vinyl leather left over and decided that rather than throw it away or to try and find a use in the future, let's use it now. So I made a little pouch. And I have to say I'm not crazy about working with this again, but for now it did okay. I kind of like it. Thanks for stopping by. We'll see you next time.